Hey Amanda, happy Wednesday. Uh, I wanted to get you this video before another day passed and then it just turned into a week and then however long, you know, what happens. As soon as I miss one video, I miss them all. Um, I'm exhausted. I have started my job. It's around 8 o'clock here. Um, and I don't know if it's just because I went from having like nothing to do to having, you know, uh, like a 9 to 6 job that I'm just so overwhelmed with it and so tired, but I just, there are not enough hours in the day right now to do everything that I want to do. I just, eventually, hopefully I'll get the balance of it. Um, but as of right now, you know, I wake up at seven, get to work by nine. <laughs> I've only had three days of work. I'm like already like, <laughs> um, but get to work by nine, get off at six, get home by seven. And then, yeah, I um, cook dinner clean up the apartment because somehow despite the fact that I'm not here the apartment gets messy very very quickly because in the morning and at night I'm like cooking and then it like piles up and I don't blah. anyway work is good um I'm essentially there to write um they I'm not feeling I found out that I'm not filling in for anyone like it's a temp position but it's it's just because I needed um like an extra hand on staff because they're going through like a lot of staff changes right now um higher up editors keep um leaving um keep getting promoted to you know other publications better jobs um and so they've done a lot of shuffling around with the staff which means that you know a lot of stuff is falling through the cracks so essentially it's just my job to be there and um take the stories that no one else wants to write essentially they have like a big google i'm on the web team um not the magazine team um so I, i'm gonna be writing every day which is cool um but there's like a big google doc of um of like stories every day and you know they're writers and editors and editorial mm -hmm. assistants and everyone who you know writes for the sites will sign up for them and it's my job to take the stories that no one signed up for by about noon and write them um which is a little annoying because what's what's cool or no not annoying it's not annoying it's my third day I'm sure that like I'll eventually get off the, like the bitch pile of stories but it's funny because um, every morning everyone on the web staff has to send like you know, four pitches to the to the, the main editors of each channel, which is like the sections. There's like the sex and love channel, the fitness channel, the weight loss channel, the health channel, um, the life channel, that kind of thing. Um, and so to all those editors, and those editors like pick of, you know, the pitches and, you know, as like then we'll put them on the Google Doc, the ones that they think are good. And then the regular editorial staff gets to like sign up for those stories. So... <laughs> Um, I, uh, my editor or the person who was directly above me warned me like, oh, you know, it's like, get your pitches in. It's great practice, but you know, don't, don't worry if yours aren't picked. I mean, like there's a large pool of them. Um, and you know, you'll get the hang of it and get, get the hang for the, for the magazine's voice. And, um, the past two days, like three of my pitches each day, so like six of my pitches so far have been picked to put up, be put on the Google Doc, but then people sign up for them, or they assign it out to other people, so I'm like, let me write my own stories, I really want to, um, but, uh, no, instead I've been writing, I've been doing a lot of slideshows, um, a lot of, like, sh news short write-ups, you know, bitch work, essentially, um, and then I have a lot of downtime. It's unfortunate because, um, they had to put me at an open desk and, um, an open desk just happens to be in like a different department. So I'm away from the entire web team. I didn't talk to a single person today. Like, I really hope that eventually I'll, I'll be able to like get to know people at work. But as of right now, I'm just kind of in exile in my own little corner. I do have a window, which is nice, but I'm just so alone. Um, welcome to desk life. Other than that, um, Yeah. That's about it. I'm really tired when I get home, and, like, I eventually have aspirations to, like, both, like, write and work out when I get home, but it's just right now it just seems so impossible. I hope I, like, start to get used to it uh, more, otherwise I'm just gonna die. Like, right now I'm currently deciding, do I want to shower, do I want to read, or do I want to get some writing in? Because either way, I want to go to bed in an hour. <laughs> Help. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's about it. Um... Hopefully I'll have some cool stories for you eventually. Hopefully all of my videos are not, yep, sat at my exile's desk, wrote some boring stories, came home. I don't know. I, it's whatever. I, um, I'm getting paid to do it. Not well, mind you, but I am getting, I am getting paid to do it. Um, so yeah, I just have to kind of get out of my comfort zone and, um, uh, reach out to people 
you know, who who work there, I'm going to try and be like, oh, I'll, I'll, like, email people and be like, oh, hi, you know, I, I'm the temp here and I really want to, you know, pick your brain, can I sit down and talk to you about your job, that kind of thing, like, informational interview is kind of, like, a thing, um, but yeah, anyway, that's me, oh, of course, I got your birthday present, or your present for me today, for my birthday, not your birthday, uh, Zerg, apparently there's one more package, I'll, um, look forward to it, but Zerg was amazing, so thank you, although I do have to admit, when I got the package, um, I, um, it, it said it was from dad, and I thought it was going to be an iPhone, because, um, I, I like mom and dad are gonna get me an iPhone for my birthday, and so I keep talking to mom about it about getting it taken care of, and she's like, Ugh, I'm just gonna make your dad take care of it, and like slowly every day my my phone is deteriorating and it's gonna die soon, so I'm like, you really have to get off of it or right, get get on this, mom, and she's been um like kind of I don't know stalling, and so I was like, is this why they've been stalling? Did they send me the iPods or the iPhone straight? But no, they didn't. It was Zerg. But I was happy with it. <laughs> Anyway, okay, I, um, I'm gonna go shower and then decide what I want my one leisurely activity of the day to be. Woohoo, adult life. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow and I'll talk to you on Friday. Yeah.